Hi there, students. A vessel. A vessel is a countable noun. OK, the first meaning of vessel is a large boat or a large ship. OK, so a cargo vessel, a shipping, uh, a fishing vessel, a naval vessel. Yeah, it's just a rather formal word for a boat. You can probably use it about an aeroplane or a spacecraft as well, but I think I would probably restrict myself nearly always just to use it, using it for large ships. Yeah, so um, we w went on a cruise in a vessel that was uh, 28,000 tons. Now, we can also use this vessel, this word vessel, to talk about a container something that's used to hold liquid yeah so um he poured the uh liquid into a vessel so that everybody could drink from it notice again this is a formal meaning the 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 the, the vessel for a ship is a bit formal i think this is probably more formal and literary yeah, um, he had a collection of uh, Elizabethan drinking vessels. Yeah, it could be made of metal, it could be made of glass, it could be made of pottery. Okay, a vessel. Yeah, a container for liquids. And then that you can use metaphorically to talk about a person who has a particular quality or he, who is used uh for a particular purpose yeah so um yeah he uh th this young um yeah that's good um uh, greta thunberg se seems to be a vessel for the green movement yeah um she's used for this particular purpose um a uh, a politician who is a vessel for change in our society this sounds pretty literary as well yeah um he's a vessel for change he's a vessel for um the accomplishment of this objective yeah um i guess the uh, army is a vessel for politicians um um uh, foreign affairs yeah it's a, a way to do something yeah i guess you could use a big ship to do that yeah a vessel and then finally vessel a vessel in medicine is a tube that carries blood or liquid through the bodies so particularly a blood vessel yeah the blood vessels the veins and blood vessels in in your body okay so a uh, vessel yeah a a craft uh, a craft for transportation on water but probably bigger than some little tiny boat it's a big vessel yeah um a uh, a vessel a container for liquid L we need to find a vessel to put this um used oil in yeah a bowl a cup a goblet a pitcher and then a vessel a person yeah a container of qualities or feelings so um a teacher should be a vessel of knowledge a teacher should be a vessel to uh impart knowledge to uh the people uh, a holy man should be a vessel of morality he, they should be a vessel to teach people the difference between right and wrong and then finally a vessel a blood vessel yeah something that carries fluid you could have uh, vessels in a plant as well that trans that carry carry the water yeah notice you have this uh, idiom um what's it the um huh. something like a vessel vessel I got for her. now now it's gone from me i'll remember it in a second okay so a vessel let's look at formality that's it 
empty vessels make the most noise. Uh, people who are empty or don't know about anything mm, complain the most loudly. Empty vessels make the most noise. Sorry about that lapse. Okay, so a vessel, a ship, um, a container, a person carrying a quality or a person uh, trying to ca use to carry something out yeah and then finally a blood vessel let's see formality I think the ship I would give a six in formality I think all the others 6.5 to 7 um, I wouldn't use the, this word informally really semi-formal conversation or above and then as to origin um, from uh, uh, vasellum from vasellum from vasculum which is uh, which uh, comes from vas meaning a vessel okay so it hasn't changed much so enough if you enjoyed the video give it a rating subscribe to my channel and I will see you soon bye for now vessel